it is. Go, 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 go time. Now you've got to get the pressure on. Get into those pedals quickly. And the pack on the way up. Has everybody got out safely? It looks like it. Tight right turn up onto the bridge. The bridges are big. They are steep. The charge is coming on the front though, Lucinda Brand dives around the uh, corner, but now Fem Van Amper already makes a move up on her to the uh, side and past Lucinda Brand, so the world champion into this tight left corner. So a vast uh, running number, wrap 59 immediately behind Alvarado who uh, takes uh, the back of that group. Van Empel in front of being followed by Brand. A little bit of, of uh, gaps opening, small gaps opening up. <laughs> Looks like a PC a buddy hopping that dies down the inside there. It's allowed us to catch and pass to Murray Schreiber. So that's at the moment really uh, throwing the bike into all of those corners. You can see Alvarado just losing ground to the leader. She's falling back into the clutches of Mary Schreiber. Is this uh, a case that uh, she's already got the World Cup win and she's now thinking to ball? It's the World Championships. It'd be nice to have a double and it's certainly not impossible. Now, Alvarado really starting to drift backwards here. And at the moment, Van Ampel opening up the gas. It's going to leave a brand on the chest. It's a brand taking a gel here. She's got a hand off the bar. She is, so it's going to be a gel to try and refuel up here. And it's allowed a little bit of a gap to open up. So just watching Vass, oh, just comes to a standstill there. And she comes up, Schreiber could dive around the outside. That's a little bit of a stall, that was just a slide out. Two riders at the front, the gap now 13 seconds. So a substantial gap starting to build to Vass because of that error. Lucinda Brand and Fem Van Ampel being chased by the two riders hitting the uh, tarmac now behind. But as they come up to the uh, line, the gap really has opened between Lucinda Brand, Fem Van Ampel at the front. Schreiber comes strongly up this tarmac straight before. As they go underneath, it's nine seconds. Currently in fifth place, Puck Pedersen. That's really is on a uh, mission now to try and close that gap down. Schreiber maybe just paying for the uh, chase through. Oh, big mistake there by uh, Lucinda Brand. She got that horribly wrong. How she saved that? There. She nearly high-sided it over the barriers. What a uh, save. Well, that little wobble has allowed Vass to close up a little bit more here. Brand looks over her shoulder. It's a Vass. Vass is back with the two leaders. And when the gap starts to open here, they open very, very fast. Brand keeping this pace high. Here we go, it's Brand Corner. She gets around that right hand turn. Time is running out for the riders behind. Vass is holding a wheel number three. She can't afford to let too much of a gap go. Or oh, a little bit of an overlap there as Fen Van Empel dives up the inside. Fen Van Empel having to watch in front and behind. And Vass starts to make a move down the right hand side. Now you can descend down here. She takes the right hand line for the riders. Our left hand side, that means she's going in tight. She'll go out wide. She's going to lead up here. That means she should, should be leading in to the sprint but she's got to have fast legs up here and the riders are almost all side by side here but who's got the inside line it's Vass the better remount came from Van Empel she's on to the tarmac she's going to lead this out it's going to be a long one from Van Empel she's already winding this out has Vass got any answer to the power of the world champion who is winding this up surely this is going to be Fem Van Empel crowning the end of the World Cup with a win the world champion who took victory here last year she takes victory this year. 
No problems at all, she says. Vast going to second place, and Lucinda Brand hits a podium. Brand of Vast and of Van Empel. It may not have been her day here today, but it's been her season. It's Sally Navarado, your World Cup winner for the 2023-24 UCI Cyclocross World Cup winner. And I'll tell you something, I'm really looking forward to next weekend when we go to the Worlds in Tabor.